Hi everyone, so this is it. This is really easy, easy. I'm gonna show you what I got from our trip in Amsterdam. Mostly it's makeup, of course, and some nail polish from Kiko Milano and some from England, some from drugstore, like a drugstore makeup. I got some blush on and lipstick and I love their lipstick guys. So yes, it's on my face now. I put all of it, I mean, I tried all of it, and this is the look that I made. So if you wanna know what's my verdict about this makeup that I got, keep on watching. So I already prepped my skin. I'm just gonna start doing the makeup, yes. So since I told you guys that I love matte makeup because I have an oily skin, as you can see, Yes, starting to get oily. Matte face base makeup. So yes, this is what you put first, like a primer before putting makeup on. Smart hydrating foundation. I didn't like it that much because it doesn't blend perfectly on my skin this is this doesn't work dark circle tone eraser it promises to erase your dark under eye i'm not sure if this concealer will suit me It doesn't smell anything, so it's good. I like it. I like concealer that doesn't smell anything. Why my face looks like so oily? I did not buy any setting powder because, because I am not interested to their setting powder because I like my Laura Laura Mercier is the best so I'm just gonna use mine oh the contour that I got is not from Kiko Milano but from Inglot I already put them in this palette now I'm gonna try it it's this one And I'm gonna contour my nose as well because we're Asian, don't have pointed nose. <laughs> and this contouring powder is not really my favorite. I mean, it's not my favorite color because is not so I also bought another brand which is this is I think this is drugstore now it's from Primark Primark it's it's like their biggest one of their biggest shopping malls so I got the blush from them this is like this is two euro so it says PS blush high pigment blush so let's see if it's really high pigment it's this color it's a little bit pink Ooh. Ooh. that's that's super pink i didn't expect that mm. Yes, it's pigmented, but it's hard to blend. You see? It's hard to blend, guys. I don't know. I need to use my finger. I don't know if you can see it, but I think I... I don't know. I don't know, guys, if you can see it, but this blush on, it's hard to blend because I think it's too pigmented. Or I don't know. 
it's not blendable. Well, it's just two euros, so what can you expect? So let's do the eyebrows. Lasting eyebrow gel. Yeah, I already tried this guys. So if you've seen my eyebrows in the entire videos, this is what I'm using and it is long lasting. It lasted the entire day after the long strolls in the city of Amsterdam. And my eyebrows are still on fleek despite the heat, the rain and the walking. So you guys will see. What I like about this eyebrow gel when when it dries up I and then you blend it with a brush, it becomes like a powdery type. So it doesn't really um, look like a gel to me. So it still looks natural. Alright guys, so I'm done doing my eyebrows. Let's now I'm going to eyeshadow. I got eyeshadow from Kiko Milano as well. I got the powder. It's two shades. It's like dark brown and I'm not sure what is this really, but it's like shimmery milk milky color like that. So I think you can use this as Highlighter as well. Let me just show you the swatch. That I developed a swatch. So, not bad. This is actually on sale. Look at that. 175. 1 euro and 75 cents. And I actually have a lot of colors. Blue. I got. I got blue, green, and yellow, but I'm not using it. But I'm not gonna try, I mean, I'm not gonna do it on my face today. But maybe next time, and this is the brown. I like this one because it's a pang kilay, guys, and pang contour nilin, siguro. And also, I got this. Eyeshadow stick. This one. It's like pink. Let's try their eyeshadow without primer on. If it's pigment enough. I think it's pigmented. Not bad for one euro and seventy-five cents. Since I like a natural looking eyeshadow, I chose this color and a light lighter pink. Let's now try the eyeshadow stick. I'm just putting it all over my lid. I think eyeshadow stick is good if you're in a rush because you don't need a brush to blend it, you just use your finger. Alright, so now I will be using this eyeshadow as highlighter and the inner corner of my eye. Also on my brow bone. Wow, it's blinding. I like to put um, same eyeshadow that I use uh, to contour my eyes under my waterline. Gives you an illusion that you have a bigger eyes. It's time to do the eyeliner. It's really pointed, so it's easy to make a um, wing eyeliner. I'm 
done with the eyeliner, it's time to go to mascara. Ultra Tech Volume and Definition Mascara. Let's see if it will really give me the volume and the definition that they are promising. What do you guys think? Well, it gives me definition. Yes, but not volume. Because I think it's the wand. Their wand is not so good. It gives me the definition, but not much volume. But it's for you, so what do you expect, guys? So, let me do my lipstick now. I got lipstick from from Primark, same as where I got this blush on. It's two euro. I did not buy lipstick from Kiko Milano because actually I have a lot of lipstick. I don't need it. It just that I saw this matte lipstick and it's nude so why not smells like cookie no it doesn't smell cookie it smells like coffee actually or it's just me it's like caramel it smells caramel. Well, it's not so matte, like super matte. It's like creamy matte, but I think I like it. I think I like this look. For everyday look, this is really good. I actually got the creamy eyeshadow as well, but I'm gonna use it as highlighter. The girl said you can use this as highlighter, so I'm just going to show you a swatch. Look at that, guys. Mm. It looks promising. Let me try it. Can you see that? Can you see the glow, guys? Gosh. I think I can see them. Glow! It's glowing! Okay, I think I'm done with my look. I'm done with everything. So, I'm just gonna put the fixing spray. What do you call this? Face makeup fixer to set my makeup. Alright guys, so I'm done trying all the makeup that I got from Kiko Milano and some from Inglot and Primark, the drugstore makeup. Um, so far, I like everything except the hydration or the Smart Hydrating Foundation because it's a little bit cakey, it doesn't blend well, especially on my nose area. As you can see it it's not well blended and it doesn't absorb my skin everything that I got from Kiko Milano are good except that one I don't like it but my most favorite like what I told you it's the face base the primer uh, the matte and the radiance boost which I always use every time I do my makeup also with regards to Inglot um, I love Inglot they're highly pigmented uh, but I didn't like the color of the contour that I got since I have an acidic type of skin that kind of color of contouring powder turned orange after an hour or so so I didn't like that much but um, all in all I like Inglot makeup I use it a lot as well same as Kiko Milano I can recommend Kiko Milano except it's not available in the Philippines it is not available 
here in Norway as well, but you can order it online and have it delivered to you. I'm not sure if they deliver to the Philippines, but they deliver here in Norway, so I don't have a problem with it. So that's it. Highly recommendable. Kiko Milan. You guys should buy it and try it for yourself. So guys, yes, like what I told you, aside from makeup, I got some nail polish as well. Even though I'm not into nail polish, like so, like so, those, oh, I'll need up. Like this four color, it's red, nude, pink, and blue. I don't know why I got this. Maybe I can just give it to some of my friends. Yes. Yeah, guys, I know you like nail polish. I'm not into nail polish, as you can see, I don't know. Also, guys, I'm gonna work out today, so this makeup is gonna put on test if it's gonna be long lasting, you know. And after I work out, I'm gonna show you guys how I look like. So, guys, I'm done with my workout, and this is how I look like. So, you guys, as you can see, the foundations, foundations. <laughs> The foundation is almost gone, but the rest is still here. Like eyeshadow, eyeliner, mascara, blush. Do I still have a blush? Like pink, pink here? Yeah. Yes, so yes, I still have a blush. I'm not sure about the. Uh, how about contour? Like here. What's that? <laughs> contour, babe. Okay, wait. I need to see. Yeah, I still have contour. But you see guys, the foundation is almost gone because it's not full coverage. But all I can say, the rest are still looking good, right? Yeah. Do I look pretty, babe? Yes, always. Yes. You see guys, I'm look I look pretty even without makeup. For him. <laughs> Ike san? Yeah. Yes, so I guess Kika Milano the best. Yes! <laughs>